Transcranial Doppler ultrasound imaging is a type of ultrasound that we use to take pictures and listen and look at color pictures of the vessels inside the brain. Uh, most people are most familiar with ultrasound as a pregnancy tool, um, but we use ultrasound for a wide variety of things. Um, and, and there's a lot of specifics. We use it to look at the heart. We use it to look at any kind of an artery or vein um, in addition to organs. And this for transcranial Doppler imaging, uh, we're specifically looking at the blood vessels in the brain using that same ultrasound technology uh, just with a different training and modality. With our exam, we bring the machine to the room and we take some pictures. There's no, there's no IV, there's no vena puncture. Um, they get to stay there with their family. And you know, it's, it's no different than just having any other ultrasound at your bedside. Um, and, and I think family members find it more peaceful. They get to kind of see what we're doing. They're interested in what we're doing to their family members. Um, and it kind of helps them understand what we're looking for um, and the, the testing tools that we're using. We'll utilize this technology in a, in a few ways. Again, probably the most prevalent will be evaluating those, evaluating those patients who have had the subarachnoid hemorrhage, the bleeding in their brains to look for any kind of uh, vasospasm, spasm of their arteries, again, to judge their treatment, how we're gonna regulate their blood pressure, their fluid status, et cetera. The other ways it'll be used is you can look at the intracranial arteries to assess a stroke patient and how they're doing and the seriousness of their injury. But it has so many applications that we've really barely scratched the surface with. And as this technology evolves to the point where it has today, there'll be even more and more uses for it.